about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know Hi friends, it's Lindsay with Emeralds of Fairy Lights I'm here today for an unboxing Look at this little teeny, teeny tiny <laughs> DIY or Dye Moon Shop diamond painting so cute they wrap it up so cute and they did this cute ribbon on it and so i'll definitely keep that ribbon because i do tie my canvases up after i finish them so if you're wondering why i have this little small package this is actually part of my um, video series where I did, I unboxed four small paintings in the small size to see what the renderings turned out like. So, um, so um, as, I, as I was saying, I unboxed four small pieces from um, Dye Moon Shop in their smallest renderings available. And this one I got. So I will just show you <laughs> really quick. This is the original. So this was in Candy Drills and this is Love Machine by Leilani Joy. Now, um, I do have to say that I, this is, this didn't work so well for me in this size. And part of it I think is not necessarily the fault of the rendering, but more the fact that crystals, there's not enough variety to make a small painting like this, this one work for whatever reason, you know, um, I just didn't think like the hair translated well, um, other things didn't look so great. Um, so I did contact Dye Moon Shop about this and the other candy drilled painting that I gotten. They did offer to send me a replacement of the other one. For this one, they offered to send me a replacement in the drills of my choice for $20. And I thought, hey, why not? Let's let's see what they look, because <laughs> um I had an order coming and so I didn't have to pay shipping. Now that's a whole other story though because that shipment, um, those got delayed and so they're still coming, but this one came by itself so I didn't have to pay shipping. So still, I still got this one for 20 bucks. Um, and so let's just get into this wrapping. I did um, ask for round drills this time around, and I was actually pleasantly surprised by my the rendering of the smallest size one that I got in round drills. They do package these so nicely, even for a replacement painting. So, let's look at this. I'm actually really excited. I do think this is such a fun image. And um, I, should, I should cut this like off camera just because I think a lot of people get stressed out when they see people cutting and I promise I won't cut myself um, and I won't cut the painting I didn't cut through the actual cardboard so just in case you're worried about that okay so Already, this is a very different feel. <laughs> I can tell you from the previous canvas. It has a soft backing. Um, this, this does not have a soft backing on it. Sorry, mine's a little dirty, but it traveled with me like to Hawaii and stuff. So that's, it's my fault. This one is soft. So, 
Canvas upgrade. I saw there's some things that are a little different, but this will be interesting to see. I think that's great when companies are like making improvements and stuff, you know, just trying to make their product better. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Here, let me adjust my camera. Okay. So hopefully that gives you a little bit of a better view. I know there is some glare, but already this canvas does um, feel softer, I can tell you. And then I think this is neat. Look, they have a legend right here on the bottom. And can you guys see this? <gasps> Look at how clearly that is printed. This is a huge step up in my opinion. Okay, no, seriously, that makes me so excited. Um, I do think that the printing on this canvas is is very clear. I know um, some of my other Dye Moon Shop canvases have kind of struggled. So, wow, they are making great improvements on their canvases. So, and that, like, like I, this ledger on the side of the canvas is seriously awesome. I wonder if they still send you one in the drill package. I guess we'll have to see. Let me roll this back the other way. As this is a poured glue canvas, you can roll these canvases um, the other way. And then they lay flat. So pretty. Okay, so let's see. Um... I do think that like right away, one of the things that I didn't think rendered so well on the old painting with the hair, I can see that it looks like the hair is going to be able to have a much better like um, grading of colors across the board, like with regular drills. So, Inside here, we did, we did get another list, but this does, this looks like it's more of a paper list. But that's so cool. So we get here a gift with some stickers. Just some cute stickers. Oh, Silence of the Lambs. That's kind of like a scary sticker. <laughs> I've never seen that movie. And I don't think I ever plan on seeing that movie. I'm, I'm not a scary, I'm not a scary movie person. And then our toolkit, which is just, let's see, we've got our boat, some wax. There's actually another thing of wax in here. And we have got two pens with seven placers already attached, some tweezers. And then let's look at these drills. So I do see that these are in this kind of bagging so before they were kind of like packed nice stacked but this i wonder if that's how they're just doing the drills now now getting packets of 200 each or whatever you know is in each bag it's not the funnest but it's definitely not the worst either so yeah it does look like we have got all of our drills so, here is our total sheet, and I like that they have this with the bags, that they at least let us know that they have as many bags, that way we can count. So, um, overall, I'm really happy with the improvements that they're making on these canvases. Oh, also, um, guys, I have to tell you, these drills look like they're resin. <gasps> Did they switch to resin drills? I just noticed this. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is another major bonus. <gasps> yes, tell me if I'm wrong, but guys, these look like they're resin drills. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see what this looks like on the canvas. And um, I do have to say that I counted and I do have all of the baggies of drills. So, but guys, wow. I, 
I am excited. <gasps> that just makes me so excited for them. I hope their squares look resin too. If their squares are resin, I might actually be willing to do a square. So better. But overall, guys, I am like really impressed with these beveled edges, the new canvas, having this down here that is so clear. The printing is a lot clearer. Stickiness feels great. Um, the canvas, it looks very pretty and clean. Um, I haven't really had issues with, with that, but I know that some people have, but honestly, it looks very clean. So I, I'm a really happy. I think that, um, Dime Moon Shop is really upping their game on their canvases. So let me know what you guys think, and I will be completing this as a continual continued part of my small painting renderings series and um i will see you guys in the